So what we have today is a, I will say it is as close as you can get to an official announcement without actually being an official announcement. And um, this came from Forbes, who had an interview with James Cameron. And in this interview, he was discussing why he sold his coastal ranch and located in California. And during this um, interview, he says, I'll just go down to the quote here that I uh, clipped. And on Avatar, I'm working in Wellington in Los Angeles. And on the new Alita, Alita Battle Angel films, I'll be working in Austin. So it just didn't make sense for us anymore. He, um, he did use films. That's plural. So, um, I think he is definitely following through with his original plan to make a trilogy. At least, hopefully, at least, um, and he says he will be working in Austin. Austin is where Troublemaker Studios is. Robert Rodriguez is Troublemaker Studios. So uh, I, would, I would guess that Robert Rodriguez is coming back to direct. And um, maybe Cameron may be more present this time around than he was in the past. Um, who knows? I know um, he has a lot of Avatar things to do. But anyway, so he's going to be double doing double duty here in Wellington, in Los Angeles, and also in Austin. Now, um, again, this is not an official announcement, but it is pretty uh, close to being official. It's, I'm not sure if we should ever expect um, anything from Disney, um, I mean, aside from schedule. maybe So maybe an announcement, so to speak, isn't what, 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 I, what I should be expecting from them. But anyway, James Cameron himself has said that he is or he will be working on the new Alita Battle Angel films. Um, I want to say that, yeah, this is a win for us who, who um, continue all these years later, these four years, almost going on five years later, to... Um, be the advocates, you know, as the, as John Landau said, to be those advocates for Alita, and to continue to show support, and to make uh, make our our desire for a sequel known. Because without that, I do not believe we would be talking about a sequel right now. Um, ever since that re-release and James Cameron saying, "Hey, we're with you, Alita Army." I I think Alita's life she she came back to life basically. You know, I really do believe that was a turning point with that um re-release and I should be showing you the um tweets from that time instead of just talking about it show or show not tell, right? Um but I don't have time to dig that up right now. And most of you who who remember those tweets remember that um Robert Rodriguez sounded, if if you can sound <laughs> away through text, he sounded excited. He says, "Yes, thank you, Alita Army. Thank you. What? Why? What did? What did they? What exactly did he say thank you for? Was it just for the re-release, or was that the time? Was that the moment they decided they were going to make a sequel? And that was um, twenty twenty, right? Yeah." When um, the re-release happened. So. Anyway. Again. Um, thanks for. Continuing to. Um, support. For continuing to. Help us. Uh, with our campaigns. Our. Projects that we do in order to. Make our. Desire for a sequel known. It is appreciated. Um, I think it is going to bear fruit, and I don't know when, but maybe 2026, maybe? (laughs) We may be looking at a a sequel. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, Knowing James Cameron, it might be 2029 or something, but anyway, that's pretty much it. Uh, Yeah, thanks thanks for listening.